What's going on, Fearless Fam? Welcome to Fearless Friday. If you're new to the channel, I'm Anthony. Today, we're gonna tackle the topic of friend zones, but more importantly, how to get out the friend zone if you're in the friend zone and how to stay out the friend zone so you don't end up there again in the future. So watch until the end of the video, I'm gonna give you two things that I do. One, to get out the friend zone, that's worked very effectively, and two, how to make sure I stay out the friend zone and never get friend zoned again, all right? So let's go ahead and talk about the friend zone thing in the first place. A lot of nice guys get friend zoned, right? Because we're either too scared to be up front with a girl when we meet her, or we're hiding our lustful thoughts or desires to be with this girl in secret in the background while we're maintaining a friendship with her. And at some point when we actually do develop or build up the courage to actually put it out there and express our desire for her, to her it feels weird because we've been maintaining this friendship that's kind of been a lie because that's been the, the premise of it, but that's not really what you've been wanting. So she might feel betrayed in that and that's fair because again, what, what we're really doing to help the situation, but pretending. <laughs> so it's only fair for them to be upset about that. So I had a couple situations in my life, actually many where I was friends out and I was just lingering in the background as this guy hoping at some point to confess my undying love for this chick and to actually do it at some point years, months after the friendship has been going on only to be looked at as kind of weird, to be dismissed and rejected and looking back on it rightfully so. So I'm not even mad at that, okay? So again, before we get into the topic of it, guys, we love shooting these videos for you. If you go, if you guys love watching the videos and you guys are actually learning a lot from it, go ahead and hit like and subscribe so we can constantly hit you with notifications about when we're releasing material so that you guys can continue to level up your game and be the best naturals that you guys are naturally are because we know you guys are naturals under all the surface right under all the nice guy stuff under all the anxiety under all the worry fear doubt that you have about yourself everybody's a natural and everybody knows how to be attractive and attract so anyways guys hit like and subscribe so we can continue to pump out videos that you're interested in seeing so let's go ahead and jump into the topic getting out the friend zone so if you find yourself in the friend zone that can be a very annoying place, a very frustrating place. And in order to get out the friend zone, you're going to have to be willing to burn a bridge, right? That might be the hardest thing to deal with, especially if you've been in a friendship with a person for a very long time, years, months, et cetera, et cetera. It's gonna be very difficult for you to probably be willing to let this person go as a result of you coming out and being very honest and straightforward about what it is you're looking for. Now, the caveat to this is that you get it out, you're no longer in hiding, you're no longer in hiding, and it can only go a few ways, right? You coming out being straightforward and being like, yo, look, I like you, I'm interested in you. I'm not, I'm not really wanting to be your friend. Like, I really want to be something more. And realizing that, yeah, that might piss her off. Right. But you also have to be very firm in what you're saying, because if you waver or if you show any sign of uncertainty in it, it's going to backfire on you. Right. So be firm in it, but also be willing to burn a bridge. It's probably better if you do it sooner than later, like maybe weeks into a friendship and not months or years so that this whole thing doesn't whole friendship doesn't uh, develop based off a of false premise. And so that when you do it, you have a better chance of recovering from it and possibly turning that around to, to something that's more of an attraction based relationship or friends with benefits type thing, whatever it is that you're looking for. But you've got to be willing to burn the bridge and you've got to be willing to go for what you want and realize that at the end of it, if she decides not to be your friend anymore, or she decides that she doesn't want to go that route with you, that you're actually doing yourself a favor because being in the background wanting in desire for this girl and not expressing that is really only wasting time and it's only hurting you more in the end. So why deal with that when you can just be straightforward, let the chips fall where they may, and then move forward with the girl that you can be more honest with right off the bat. So that's how you get yourself 
out of the friend zone. Again, it's not always going to go bad. It's not always going to be the girl that's going to get mad at you, burn the bridge. A lot of times you can turn it around. A lot of times she might actually get mad at you first and then start considering you in that way. But it might come with a little bit of testing to see if you're really serious about it. Right. So don't freak out if she freaks out on you. Right. Just maintain your ground and realize that you're going for what you want and you deserve to have what you want. And you'll see if she'll open up, she'll come back or she won't. One of the two. OK, so let's get into the second thing here. How to make sure that you don't ever get friend zoned again in the future. Right. This is one of those things where it's like you have to be straightforward in your intention right off the bat when you meet a girl. If you're attracted to her, let her know that you're attracted to her. Don't hide these things, right? Be a little bit more sexually forward. Touch, flirt. You'll find out right away if she's with it or not, right? <laughs> the nice guy thing to do, and this is what I was doing back in the day, was again, being okay, being okay or pretending to be okay with having a friendship with this girl. So that means hanging out with her. She's talking about other guys that she's probably hooking up with or that she's dating and you pretending to be okay with it. And it's probably just eating you alive inside. Guys, don't put yourself in that situation. You don't need to be, right? It's much better if you're showing full intent right off the bat and then getting rejected versus living a lie. It wastes so much more time. So to avoid putting yourself in that position ever again, you got to learn how to be more direct in your in your interactions, especially in your approaches. Be straightforward. I'm here because I like you. Right. I love the way Brian always says it. He likes to tell girls that I don't need any more girlfriends. I'm not looking for girlfriends. I have enough girlfriends already. <laughs> right. I'm looking to date. And that's where my focus is. And again, if she's not with it, then that's fine. Move on and find another girl. But the key here again, be intentional. Don't shy away from your intention. I did a video on the nice guy, right? Or what I would tell my nicer guy, younger self. And that's one of the things there that's like, be straightforward. Your needs matter. Your desires matter. Your wants matter. So don't hide and try to do it in a roundabout way. Okay, guys. So anyways, guys, short video. I hope it's effective and really pushing you to be more straightforward, man, because you win when you're straightforward you don't win when you torture yourself and keep yourself in that friend zone hoping that someday she's going to realize that you like her and she's going to also be madly in love with you it, it doesn't really work that way all right guys women love a guy who creates tension step in attention and also own what he wants own his desire own his needs and not back down from it okay so anyways guys Thanks for watching, and remember, only the confident really does.